during this short video I'm going to demonstrate how to perform a product transfer back through the product return spout. Pressing the blue selection button to drive through the menus. Once product movement is displayed, press green validation to accept and proceed. Once you're in the sub menu, press the blue selection button until product transfer is displayed and then green validation to accept and proceed. The first thing we'll ask you to do is select the return valve you wish to put the product back into. So in this occasion, I would like to return through return valve number two. So I press the blue selection until return valve number two is displayed and then press the green validation button to accept. The product we are transferring is kerosene. So we'll press green validation to accept. Enter the preset volume of the transfer you wish to make. So the red modification button increases the preset volume. Blue selection moves the cursor along. So I move it along to the hundredths, press the red modification until I see 200 and press green validation to accept. It will then ask me which kerosene compartment would I like to deliver out of. As I have no other compartments of kerosene other than the one I'm returning into, which is return valve number two, and then I'm coming out of compartment number one. Press green validation to accept. And then when it says start transfer with the 200 litre preset volume flashing, press green validation to accept. During a transfer, it will automatically start in slow flow, but during the delivery, using the blue selection button, press that once until instantaneous flow is displayed, press green to accept and proceed. So as we see here, it says instantaneous flow L. If I press the blue selection button once, it will change that to H for high flow. Don't, not pressing any other buttons, it will refresh back to the delivery screen and it is now pumping that product transfer in high flow. Once the transfer has finished and it's reached the 200 litre preset, we press green validation on end transfer. It will then automatically open the check valve and blow down five seconds worth of air to clear the product return. Once that is finished, press green validation on transfer finished. Stop the engine, green validation to say yes, red modification to come back no, and then green validation to print a ticket. And then you're back to the main menu.